of style and a lot of confidence coming off the Kings bus earlier on. We'll see if their performance matches their look. A spectacular sight as we approach our broadcast location in downtown Orlando. We are nearly ready for the tip-off. Hey, good evening, Kevin. DA, the Sacramento fans would love to see that as well. Thanks so much for that report. Now Sacramento starting five. Fox and Bogdanovich pair up at the one and the two. Bagley is out there with Nemanja Bialica, and it's Barnes and at the three. And for Orlando, at the four and the five, we have Gordon and Vucevic. Fultz is out there with Evan Fournier, and it's Isaac in at the three, the small forward. Barnes outside. Passes it to Bogdanovich. Sacramento moving it around. Barnes outside. Three-pointer. Rebounded by Vucevic. They can go two for one. It's about being smart right now. Fultz against Fox. Bagley with the rebound. And here's Bogdanovic for three. It's up and it's off the mark. He's 0 for 1. Fournier passes to Fultz. Pass to Vucevic. Over Bielita. Vucevic with the bucket. Vucevic has got the first points up on the board here for the Magic. Well, Vucevic has got a number of moves he can go to. So comfortable this close to the cup. And still a close game as the first quarter comes to a close. Hope you're enjoying the game. Both teams tonight keeping things pretty even so far on the scoreboard. And guys, for the Magic, what jumps out to you so far, numbers-wise? What we saw in that first quarter, uh, they won their matchups defensively. I think across the board, a number of guys have done a great job guarding multiple positions. Gordon and Bamba, the combo inside. Terrence Ross is out there with DJ August, and it's Isaac in at the small forward position. That's the group starting the second quarter for the Magic. Now Fox, healed outside. Good, and a nice assist from Fox. Healed's got himself on the board with three there. Yeah, instinctively, too. Fox there looking to be a ball mover, a facilitator, and that's one reason why his team is playing well. And the pass to Bamba. Back to Augustine. And the dunk by Bamba. Well, excellent pursuit of the basketball by Mo Bamba. Love his effort there. Barnes looking around. Plays it up and in on the nice reverse. Man, he's got such a great touch and feel around the basket. He made that reverse look easy. And that's it for the first half of action. What's been a very close game here. Orlando out in front, leading by just one. And don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of the third quarter. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, and welcome back to the NBA on 2K Sports. Ernie Johnson here. If your name is Shaquille O'Neal, raise your hand, please. If your name is Shaquille O'Neal, raise your hand. It was a closely contested first quarter for Orlando. Their field goal percentage was a robust 50% in the period. That's something they can hang their hat on. They were outscored by just a bit in the second quarter as they go into the break now holding just a one-point advantage. And Kenny, what are your thoughts? Thanks for joining us. Second half of basketball upon us. We may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game it's been so far. Now here's Gordon on the court right now for the Kings. Fox and Bogdanovich pair up at the one and the two. Harrison Barnes is out there with Nemanja Bialica. And it's Bagley in at the center position. Barnes outside. 
to Bogdanovich. And here's Bagley. Barnes outside. Passes it to Fox. Shot clock at six. Let's it go from deep. The shot comes out. The Magic go the other way with it. And Fournier gets to Fultz. There's 14 seconds left in the third quarter of the game. Right wing. A wide open look here for Vucevic. The basket good off the assist from Fultz. Vucevic has got the lead up to five now for the man. Oh, 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 he nailed it. Yes. Wow. And it counts. Oh, beats the buzzer from way down court. These fans are stunned. And we just finished the third quarter, and we've got a... Three tenths quarters behind us. One more to go. Thanks for being with us as we begin the fourth. A moment now to reset the lineups. Back to us by Gatorade. All fueled up here for the fourth quarter. So on the floor for Orlando. Isaac and Vucevic down low. Michael Carter-Williams is out there with Terrence Ross. And it's I'm Ennis I'm in at the three spot. So much riding on that shot. What a bucket. I'll tell you, that changes things, doesn't it? Good job, young fella. What a game. Timeout called by the Kings. They're trailing by four. There's 45 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And we've got an update here, so let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Hey, Kevin. Well, Luke Walton was just talking about strategy with his team. He told them they have to keep fighting. He said, hey, look, we're right here, but we can't make mistakes. you got to be aggressive and smart. Back to you guys. Can't afford these defensive breakdowns, especially down the stretch. And right now, neither side can get a stop. Looks like both coaches will have plenty of material for the film room. Knocks down the three. Well, you can see why his teammates love playing with him. Vucevic willing to find the open guy. Timeout called by the Kings. They're behind by five. 26 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Let's present our New Balance player of the game, Nikola Vucevic. And in terms of his shooting, this has been one of the more accurate performances you'll ever see. I mean, he's been in constant motion, creating a lot of good looks for himself. But, but still, even when you're wide open, you expect to miss some of the time. Yeah, that has not been the case here tonight. This guy has made everything. Well, smart enough to know if there's going to be congestion in there when he's attacking. Barnes gets to that in-between game. Time call here. The Magic decide to talk it over. They're in front by three. We've got 22 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Fournier is checked in for Ross. And they foul intentionally. They're going to have to do that now again and again. They're not in the penalty yet. Honestly, just doing what they have to in order to get the basketball back. And he commits the intentional foul. the first one and that gives them a four-point cushion you get a little glimpse into the mindset of evan fournier this guy will do whatever it takes to win you know the crucial part of those free throws is that it now makes it a two possession game i'm deep barnes can't get it to go and they go to the intentional foul the first and that increases their lead to six and so he drops them both it's a seven point game nine seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one a three from barnes nails the triple oh with that calm demeanor barnes sticks that run right in their eye and so the big win by Orlando in a tight game. Probably a little closer than they would have liked it, but a win nonetheless. Yeah, but I really got a sense that the fans gave them that emotional boost.